Hi guys, it's Brave Bell here with another video. Uh, this time of the year, it's springtime rolling around, people are graduating from high school, from college. Um, just spring is in the air, so I figured I would do a gift giving video where I show you all of the gifts that you can make um, for the special people in your lives for this season. Uh, the first is kind of silly, bringing back a childhood trend. and. I'm making a macaroni picture frame. So what you will need for this is one family size box of mac and cheese. I mean any size frame works, but I think four by six works the best. A tiny little glue gun, your weapon of choice. And a picture of your loved one. So, mine is of me and my boo on Halloween. And I'm doing this because we're going to be celebrating one year together pretty soon. So, that's pretty exciting. Alrighty, so I'm just going to pop the picture in the picture frame. Passing down all the little doohickeys. Ba, ba, ba. Ba. I'm going to do hickeys too soon. Alrighty. The picture is in the frame and we can start gluing. So just take your bedazzled scissors or whatever you have. Open your mac and cheese box. Alrighty. Take out the cheese packet and get your needles prepped. Alright, so you can start. Ah, it's hot. Ah. Ah. Just putting glue wherever you want in the frame. Be careful because it's hot. Just lightly pressing your mac and cheese in there. If you want to go fast, you can if you have like a low cooling or a low heat glue gun, but I would prefer not to get really bad burns just doing a macaroni picture frame. And this is going to take me a while, so I'll probably only do one side so I don't waste time. Ah, it's beautiful so far. I always love this type of stuff. Like, trust me. They think that, like, mac and cheese picture frames are the coolest. They're like, oh my god. Who am I dating? A three-year-old? I'm shaking because I'm terrified. It's my first time using a hot glue gun. cheap picture frame. I wouldn't spend too much on it, considering the fact that you're just about to... Uh, uh, that you're just about to uh, glue a bunch of mac and cheese to it. I wouldn't really worry about getting the best quality. These were all breaking apart, actually. Beautiful. So, once you have it all around, it's just going to look like that. I'll show you guys the finished project when it gets done, but I realized halfway through that, that's going to take forever. So once it's finished, just imagine that all over it, and it'll be a cute little gift. Alright, so the next thing I have is not do it yourself. And they're just little fun things that you can give people throughout the year. So the first thing I have is like a mug of summer. 
So this is a really cool friend that my friend Chinda gave me for my graduation party. It's classic Winnie the Pooh, and it says good friends will stick with you until you're unstuck. And it's so true. So what I decided to put in here is any little stuffed creature. Um, I've had this since I was like two. His name's Krabby Cakes. He goes with me everywhere. Um, I actually got these from a friend who didn't want them. They're just cheap, flimsy sunglasses, but I think macaroni colored. I think that that's a cute way of like, I don't know, just showing the mug of summer. And then my friend Shelly gave me this super cool nail polish. It actually changes color in the sun from pink to purple. So that's just a cute little basket. Wouldn't cost you much. And I also have just a touch of jewelry. This only cost me like 99 cents on some website. I unfortunately don't remember it. But yeah, so it's super cheap and it's just a little bracelet. It's a cute way of saying I'm thinking about you or congratulations on graduating high school or yay, yeah, it's summer. Uh, the next thing I have is super simple. Stick, stick. And it's a do-it-yourself to-do list. And this you use with the same picture frame that I just showed you, just four by six. You just take a so you just take a piece of notebook paper and you just line it up on top and cut where you want it, stick it in there as though it were a picture. And then the super cool thing about this is because it's glass, you can just write and wipe. Voila! You can just make a little to-do list, and this would be perfect for someone who's, you know, going to college or is super duper busy and wants a cute little to-do list to set on their desk and write and check off. And I think that's a super cute way of doing that. Um, I actually attached, didn't attach, just for decoration, like a cute little bow or something. And the last thing I have is just like, bleh, there we go, cute little bag. You can just do like a beauty type of themed gift. So in here I have a Cosmo magazine or any magazine, just pick one that they like or you think they would like. Um, and then I have a bunch of different products. Well, not a bunch, but um, you want to give them like the ultimate checklist of like stuff that makes them feel good. So this is actually my favorite clay mask. It's by Freeman's, and it's chocolate and strawberry, and it's just like dessert for your face. And it smells super good, and your face just feels super fresh after using it. And then I have just this cute little Victoria's Secret, it's almost empty, perfume. It's pretty and pure, and it smells like that. And then you got to make sure their locks are looking sexy. So I recommend Not Your Mother's Beach Babe Salt Texturizing Spray. It's actually really, really good, and it leaves your hair smelling like coconuts and the ocean without the grittiness. And then once you're all beautified, you can just kick ass all day by giving them a Nerf gun. Bah! So that way they can kick ass well feeling awesome. Well, I hope you liked this video. It was just kind of last minute and just kind of a way to give you guys some gift ideas. Thank you so much for tuning in again and have a nice day. Grace Bell out.